Hello guys, recently I bought this Novation Zero SL MK2 media device, but as I'm working in FL Studio, well it's not well programmed for that. The auto map functions doesn't work, so you have to program everything yourself. And uh, I'm gonna save you some time and show what can you do when you boot the device first time, because I have spent about two or three days to figure out how can you program this device and uh, so when you switch it on for the first time it's an auto map mode but you don't need that it doesn't work so you switch it off you press the template select button and here you have some pre-installed templates and you see there's an FL Studio template so you press the third button to switch it on and what it has, it has uh, all the buttons and knobs programmed but not mapped with FL Studio. So you have to program yourself except those three switches and the transport buttons. So with those three you can select the uh, patterns. So it's a pattern switch. The second knob is a mixer channel switch and the third one is a channel switch here transport buttons work as they should work I'm sorry for example here play button works stop works everything good the record button works it's okay but if you want to control something with the sliders or knobs right here you have to program or map them yourself FL Studio Guru has a pretty good video I'm gonna show you quickly how it's done uh, for example you want to control the frequency sweep yeah so you press the right button link to controller and you toggle your switch and it's mapped for example here okay that's how you can map all your mm, sliders and switches but if you want to program them for the other FL Studio projects you simply select override generic links and then toggle the switch and you can use those knobs in every FL Studio project but uh, I will show you in my next video how you can use that and I will show you how you can program all the sliders and knob with a special program and program your special template and so you could use that in every FL Studio project but in this video I will show you how you can choose your first template your boot up template so you press the global button here you see startup you choose that and you can choose the number of your template for example the FL Studio was the third one you press the right button and you see that saved you switch the device off you switch it in and you see it booted with the third template okay guys until next time when I, where I will show you how you can program those knobs and sliders and I will show you how you can program these eight uh, sliders to control eight or even more 1624 uh, mixer channels in FL Studio only by those eight sliders. Okay, goodbye guys.